Hello and welcome to Season A, where the platform where we speak truth to power. We are back again. Uh, we are doing a lot of stuff in terms of numbers and figures, and we want you to have this information. It's very, very important. I'm going to make it smaller. Let me make it smaller. So I want you to see the full figure. I'm trying to, let me, I'll, I'll stretch it out first. So I'm going to do this because I want you to see those figures yourself. So I'm just trying to put it up, you know, so you can see. Let me see if I can make it bigger on this side. So, because I just want you to be able to see those figures and then the information that's there. Because that's why I'm trying to do this. The song keeps asking, how long? How long going to get it so far? By the way, you see me wearing Yoruba Nation, uh, you know, I believe in it 100%. But I'm a realist. I'm a realist. My dream is for Yoruba Nation. I'm very clear about that because that is, and my language is important to me. The food I eat, the clothes I wear, my language, the culture, everything is important to me. I believe in Yoruba Nation. But we're not there yet. We're not. So that's why I'm wearing that. But the reality we face right now is we are inside what is known as Nigeria. And we need to exercise our powers of participation in governance to begin to hold the crooks in power to account. Not all of them. Some, I don't know. Anyway, the, something is not working in the system. The constitution is flawed. But I want to just show you this particular thing here. And I'll read through the section. You, need to, you all know what I do in terms of the section when it comes to the constitution in terms of uh, section 14 2 way. Um, sovereignty belongs to the people of Nigeria from whom the government through this constitution derives all its powers and authority. Section 14 2 A of the Nigerian constitution. You need that information. The second part of it, section 14 2 C. The participation of the people shall be in accordance with the provisions of the constitution. The participation of the people in their governance shall be in accordance with the provisions of this constitution. Those are the two powers that you possess as citizens. It is time to exercise it. If you think that by voting somebody in, you they will then fix your rules. You, they will not fix it. And I'll give you a case in point. This is why I'm showing you the figures on the screen here. You see these figures here? These are just for the local government areas alone. That money, nobody has explained to you where that money has gone. This is for just one local government area alone in Adoodota, local government area. This is the amount of money that was paid to them from March to December. It all comes down to 3.2 billion naira, 3.249 billion naira. That equates to 7 million US dollars from March of 2022 to December. Where has that money gone? This is the month by month breakdown that you can see there. I want you to get familiar with it. If you want this done for your community, for your local government area, any local government area, any local government area, send me a message on this box, uh, on this comment. Leave a comment in the section of this broadcast and I will give you the last 10 months. The, the 10 months, the, you, you notice that January to uh january to march is unavailable january to march is unavailable and the figures i got from the Stat bureau of statistics they have not released the one for january february march it's unavailable that's why it's showing there as unavailable on the screen but what i really want us to begin to do is to begin to question things don't wait you sh it should be none of your business what the parties are fighting over what you need to know is what you should be focusing on is how to make sure that the funds meant for your local government area gets your local government area. Because without those funds, you won't get water, light, road, schools, bridges, healthcare, safety, security, and so on and so forth. So the task is for you to really look and scrutinize the figures. I've broken it down. Tie, leave in the comment section. Leave your, your local government area that you would like me to put on the screen. Bring any... I can give you for all 774 local government areas, but I need you to participate in it. So you can now go with this information and question your local government area, uh, uh, local government chairman, your state house of assembly member, uh, member or members as the case may be, your house of reps, your house of uh, your senate. You can question them and your governors because you have this information. This is information that you need. I believe in Yoruba Nation. Let us be very clear. I'm wearing it. But I am realistic to know that it is not going to materialize unless you start taking collective action like I am showing you. If you do not participate and begin to go as a group, never go on your own. Go collectively. 
and begin to hold them to account. Let me show you one more thing before I go, and I'll wrap it up. I want to keep it short because I'm, I, you know, the information. I don't want it to take too long. Uh, let me quickly show you one more thing if I can do that quickly. Uh, okay, I just want you to know your rights, and I, I have said it before, um, but I want to really reiterate it again. So whilst you're looking at those figures, I want you to also uh, one second, please. Okay. One minute i just want to quickly I'll, I'll get that to you i just want to just show you that section of the constitution because um we need a forum i want to create a forum where every local community will have that information at their fingertips and they can actually go right okay so there we go so this is what i want you to know again just to recap on what we've done before um it's just a quick recap recap because i need you to have this information we haven't got too much time to be waiting around you need to be acting on the information that we're giving you please it says here it is hereby accordingly declared that sovereignty belongs to the people of Nigeria from whom the government through this constitution derives all its powers and authority. That is a power that you as a community possess. Secondly, section 14.2c, the participation by the people in their government shall be ensured in accordance with the provisions of this constitution. So those two powers you can combine. That means that you can hold anybody to account from the president downwards. They are answerable to you but as a community. You need to do this as a collective right now. Get on with that. Don't bother about who is elected and entering into any party. You're not interested. You want to know where the money has gone. Follow the money. Demand for those money to, in, to be able to fix the infrastructure in your local government. Without doing that, nothing will change. Follow the money. Use the powers that I show you on the screen. Act now. Act now. You're watching Citizen AY, the platform where we speak truth to power. Any local government area that you want please leave a comment in the comment box and i will do exactly the same thing that i've done now the last 10 months the, the 10 months march to december i can give you we're waiting for them they still have not released the ones for january to march because they want to do the handover and then they release it quite on the quiet put the pressure on them demand for it it is your right you're watching it is the platform where we speak to power about later on thank you bye for now bye for now